please welcome Haley Williams. Haley. <laughs> Wow, what an intro. Thank you. Uh, yeah, uh, Hayley, you aged three more years during that intro. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. I feel I feel bad because as I was reading it, I was kind of like, Haley. well, I mean, like, you've got this, you know, you, you're so experienced as a I mean, how do you feel about it? Do you feel grateful? Has it gone quick? Do you not like to hear how long you've been around? Oh, no, I I feel like uh, it, it has gone by really quickly. There's definitely some stuff I wouldn't relive and then there's stuff I would. But <laughs> we're just like kind of in disbelief that we're still in it and that people still want to hear about it. Like, it's very that we know this is rare. So. So we're just enjoying it, you know. Where are you in the world at the moment, Haley? Because I mean, obviously, we're here in Australia. Are you are you in the states at the moment? Mm-hmm. Is that where you are? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm home. We're we're back home in Nashville. Right. Okay. So what what is yeah. the what's the you know what's the rough time in Nashville at the moment? Oh, right now, I'll tell you. It is. It's eight thirty seven p.m. And are you are you a night owl? Are you going to stay up, or is this bedtime and you're straight to bed? <laughs> it's definitely bedtime. I used to be a massive night owl. Like I, especially from touring, like we we don't eat dinner until like one a.m. some nights. But when we're home, I start getting tired at like seven thirty p.m. I'm so boring. Uh, I love Lifestyles of rock show. She, she's she's doing this interview <laughs> from her bed right now. She wait, no, I really am. I really <laughs> actually. Am. Are you in bed right now? Yeah, me and and my dog Alf. We're just. At a, I've got a, also one of those. It's very woo woo, but I myself am a bit woo woo. I've got one of those grounding mats that I'm like oh, laying. On. Okay, yeah. I can imagine Alf's like, "Mom, come on, man, it's bedtime. Like, <laughs> what do you stop doing this?" I just love that. Yeah, we got we got to chat with Haley Australia, and um, before there's like a Zoom link, and Haley's like, "I'm not on Zoom." I mean, I thought you know that's fine. That's Sometimes we we chat to artists, it and it's, happen. you just get on the phone. Mm. Then Haley's like, "I'm in bed, yeah. guys." Yeah. <laughs> now and you. You know what, Haley? <laughs> now it makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I mean, Haley, let's talk about you coming back to Australia. I mean, so many people are pumped uh, for this as well. I mean, uh, you know, a lot of us, I think Jimmy and I, while we were waiting for the Zoom connection, um, we were just singing. Uh, <laughs> 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 we were, I think we were just ripping out Ain't It Fun uh, beforehand. We were worried you were going to hear it and be like, nah, cancel this bloody interview. Uh, so are you, are, you, are you excited to come back? When's the last time you were in Australia? Yeah, we the last time we were there, uh, I believe it was January 2000. 2018. You know, like being on that side of the world is genuinely it's our, it's our favorite side of the world to be on. Like being in <laughs> Australia, being in New Zealand, like we we cannot wait. Everyone's so excited. I'm I'm leading you away with this, Haley. Um, you know, there, there's only obviously one answer, but feel free to answer it any way you want. But, you know, touring <laughs> around the world, where is your favorite place to go? Oh, okay. Well, honestly, it's it's been Japan since Hayley, I was like, Hayley, it was Hayley, Hayley, Hayley. it was right the there. The answer was right it there. Was, <laughs> I forgive you because you're like probably half asleep. Yeah. <laughs> but, but okay, you, why why is it why is it Japan? Why is it Japan? I mean, I I feel like the first time we went, it was so impactful to like the the teenager that I was at the time, and like you know, it's it's where I like picked up a lot of my wanting to dye my hair crazier colors and multiple colors like all the fashion inspiration I don't know man it just it's just I just feel good on that side of the world in general and truly when if you ask the band like us as a collective what what our favorite places are like New Zealand and Australia those like being able to hit those two places on a tour or on an album cycle is such a luxury because the shows are always incredible. There's always like lots of memories that come away. We come away with, you know, like I I feel like for some reason we're just on different. Well, we are on different time there, but people just (laughs) make more time to do things together and like be out and about. 20 years uh, of like for this trajectory for Paramore, obviously you've done so many tours, you've traveled around the world. Are there like, are there things now where you're just like, I'm not sitting next to X on the bus because you you just know, (laughs) stay away from me until we're on stage, man. Like, is there there any of that? Like something that's so ingrained with you, it's like, get away from me, everybody else. (laughs) No, it sounds like you're talking about 2009 Paramore. <laughs> Harry. <laughs> That's a very different experience than today. I mean, no, we actually, we genuinely get along the whole band. I mean, now we have like, as a touring band, we're a seven piece. Obviously, the the main, you know, it's me, Taylor and Zach. But when we're on the road, um, we have four other guys that are out with us. Um, and we all just are obsessed with each other. 
our crew. We love hanging out with our crew members as well. So it's a lot of the, a lot of the people that we tour with, like on the crew side, have been with us for a long time too. So we just, yeah, it's just like a family now. And there's weird. Qu- everybody has like a weird quirk. Everyone's like a little bit sort of, you know, like a cartoon character. <laughs> but there's no, there's no like I don't want to be around him. Thank well, God. Then, what, what is the weirdest quirk that someone has within the within the greater team? <laughs> Oh no. Okay. Um one of the members keeps dying well, your hair. It's uh <laughs> <laughs> it's me. Uh, so it's definitely me. Well, one that this is going to get me in so much trouble, um but one that uh I laughed about for quite some time was Joe, our percussionist, never had his own cigarettes. <laughs> and so of the <laughs> other members of the band that smoked, it was always like, "Oh, <laughs> Joe's bumming smokes again." <laughs> but you know, but but like it, I, right now, it's it's of course it's that thing where someone asks you a question, and your mind goes blank. But every single one of us has a thing like that. Yeah, okay. and it's incredible. Actually, one of my favorite things too is um, Brian Robert Jones, who plays guitar with us live. If you go to his Instagram, he like will find different sites and different places that we go, and do, he does like slam poetry oh. about the places that he's wow. visiting, and it's all hilarious. Wow. But um, yeah, he's he's a, he's funny. He's very funny. But we're yeah, we everyone's just a. It's it's seriously like an episode of Rugrats or just a cartoon. <laughs> so what what you're saying is Haley is we should get some Aussie fans to you know just throw packs of ciggies at Joe just so we can you know pick him up afterwards. You know you've you've seen concerts where you know people throw their bras up or you know their phone numbers yeah. and all that kind of stuff. Go to a Paramount concert for throw Joe. Cigarettes at just Joe. throw some Winnie Blues at Joe, man. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, no one would. I bet you, no one would complain. I, I might. I don't want to be hit in the face, even if it's just a cigarette. Please don't tell Joe, and then if it does happen when he comes to Australia, he's like, "What the hell's going on?" Yeah, man? but also, I know. I know. I said I'm going to be in so much trouble. He's going to be like, "What do you mean?" Yeah. <laughs> He might be stoked, Haley. You know, we might take the mantle away from Japan, you know. <laughs> that's true. No, but that's for Joe. Haley's still. Oh, so of course. Hey, Haley, I want to talk about, you know, of course, Paramore known uh, for the energy and the passion on stage and really get everybody into every single song. Is Can we expect a lot more of that when you come to Australia and New Zealand as well? Is it is it much the same to, you know, uh, as we were talking before, you know, 2009 Paramore dancing around on stage or have things changed <laughs> in terms of stage presence now? Oh, it's definitely, to me, it's like the, like, in a good way, the loosest we've been. The band sounds tighter (laughs) than ever, but we are the, but we are like having so much fun. Everyone's like, just kind of, I don't know, like, it's, and it is funny because Taylor on stage is very, he's very like to himself. He has like his hair curtain that he wears in front of his face the whole time, basically, but but like everyone just has their own sort of character on stage. And I think that you get to know that throughout the night. And um, I don't know, I think it's the best we've ever been live. I really do. Um, so I'm, I'm stoked because it's nice to be able to show that to people. It's nice to be able to be like, yeah, well, you, you liked it last time. Well, wait until you see us now. Wait till you hear this. Well, look, we're really excited yeah. um, when you get down, Haley. If you listen to the show, make sure you go check them out. Uh, Brisbane Entertainment Centre, Wednesday the 22nd of November. Uh, Melbourne's Rod Laver Arena, Monday the 27th of November. Yeah. And also Sydney's Domain outside, uh, Saturday the 25th of November. Uh, the only thing I'd say, Haley, is tell Joe to wear a helmet because some of those <laughs> cigarette boxes, they are heavy, man. So... <laughs> <laughs> oh man! No, throw, so straight, throw them individual. Ungrounded. Just oh, throw yeah, individual. Throw them individual. Don't throw them <laughs> It'd be funny to watch him pick up individual ones. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Haley Williams, thank you so much. We are pumped for Paramore to come back uh, to Australia and New Zealand. You're the best.